And just into your local election headquarters, a Massachusetts gubernatorial debate just wrapping up a short time ago. The wildly popular Republican governor, Charlie Baker, facing off against Democratic challenger Jay Gonzalez. Eyewitness News reporter Caroline Goggin has been monitoring the debate, and she's live in our newsroom with more. Caroline? Well, Shannon, a ton of back and forth tonight between Republican incumbent Charlie Baker and Democratic candidate Jay Gonzalez. The two debating several issues, including public transportation, education, taxes, prison reform, and the current state of the Massachusetts State Police. And here are a couple of takeaways for you tonight. Gonzalez has recently called on the governor to fire the head of state police following a series of recent scandals. During tonight's debate, Governor Baker said he's proud of the work the colonel has done. Also tonight, Gonzalez said he would fire Keolis, the commuter rail operator, and and bring management of the commuter rail in house. The governor called that a political talking point, not a solution. Also discussed tonight, Gonzalez's plans to raise taxes on the wealthy. He proposes raising more than a billion dollars by taxing some of the Commonwealth's private universities that have large endowments, like Harvard and MIT. Governor Baker fired back on that point. He says he does not believe it's right to take away from these schools. He says that would essentially punish education. Finally, candidate Gonzalez, who worked under Governor Patrick's administration, Administration stressed that he wants to shake up the status quo. Governor Baker argued he's already done that. If I was a status quo governor, there'd still be thousands of homeless families living in hotels and motels in Massachusetts. There aren't. If I was a status quo governor, we wouldn't have a huge offshore wind and hydro program going on to replace a third of our fossil fuels with clean, renewable energy. If I was a status quo governor, Bridgewater State Hospital would still be a stain on the Commonwealth's reputation instead of the hospital that was supposed to be. You talk to families there, it's like night and day with respect to what that place was like once upon a time. It's not nearly enough. That's not an ambitious agenda. There's so much more we need to do to make a difference for working families in this state. That's who I'm gonna fight for. I'm gonna provide bold leadership on climate change. You were forced by a court to, to make progress. Uh, you got a C grade from climate organizations who think you're not doing enough, and you're not. And there was a WBUR poll that was done at the end of September. This was the result. If the election were to be held today in the state of Massachusetts, 68% of people would vote for Governor Charlie Baker. 24% would vote for Jay Gonzalez. 6% of voters at this time are undecided. That poll concluded that the biggest issue right now for Jay Gonzalez is his visibility. I'm Caroline Goggin, Eyewitness News.